Have you ever stopped to ponder the profound sweetness of life? How much of it springs from the humble stalks of sugarcane swaying in the tropical breeze? You might be surprised to know that globally, we harvest over 1.9 billion tons of this sweet grass annually. A world of sweetness indeed. Take a moment to imagine the vast expanses of sugarcane fields stretching as far as the eye can see. These emerald oceans are more than just picturesque landscapes. They are the lifeblood of a thriving industry that caters to our global sweet tooth. Now let's consider a country that has truly embraced the sweet life Brazil. Yes, the land of samba and sunshine is also the world's leading producer of sugarcane. Brazil contributes a staggering 739 million tons to the global harvest. That's nearly 40% of the world's total sugarcane production, all coming from one vibrant, bustling country. But sugarcane in Brazil isn't just about satisfying our cravings for the sweet stuff. It's about fueling a nation. You see, Brazil has harnessed the power of sugarcane in a unique way. The country is a pioneer in the production of ethanol from sugarcane, a renewable source of energy that powers millions of vehicles across the nation. And it doesn't stop there. The Brazilian sugarcane industry also plays a significant role in the country's economy. It provides employment for over 1 million people and contributes around $12 billion to Brazil's GDP annually. Brazil's relationship with sugarcane is a story of innovation, energy, and economic growth. It's a testament to the power of a single crop and the multitude of ways it can enrich a nation. So, the next time you take a sip of your sweetened drink, remember the fields of sugarcane, remember Brazil. The sweetness you taste is a tale of resilience, innovation, and the tireless work of millions. It's a testament to our global interconnectedness and the sweet, sweet life that we all share. Sugarcane, it seems, is more than just a crop. It's a symbol of sweetness, energy, and prosperity. A symbol that's deeply rooted in the soils of Brazil and in the hearts of its people.